I want to take a moment to give some props to Jamaica's The Reggae Girls. They made history, knocking out Brazil to advance into the 2023 Women's World Cup. As many of you know, there you go right there. You see them. Excuse me. You see it right there. It's a beautiful moment. Beautiful moment. Look at this. That's special. As many of you know, the 2023 Women's World Cup, jointly hosted by New Zealand and Australia, is going on. Spectacular match on Wednesday. Jamaica's the reggae girls knocked Brazil out of the tournament after a goalless draw. It's the first time Jamaica reached a World Cup knockout stage in its history. Booking a slot amongst the last 16 teams in the next round of the tournament. And for those of you who ask why you're bringing it up, because you know I have West Indian, man, you know. From St. Thomas Virgin Islands. Anytime I see something in the islands, a man loves that, my son. Trust me. I'm very, very proud of the ladies. Way to go, y'all. What makes this such a beautiful story is that the team had to set up a GoFundMe account to pay for their trip to the Women's World Cup. The fund, Reggae Girls, G-I-R-L-Z, Reggae Girls Rise Up, was set up by Sandra Phillips Brower, the mother of midfielder Havana Salon. It raised more than 45000 for their trip. Got a lot of love for y'all. Big Irie, the reggae girls of Jamaica. Keep doing your thing, ladies. Keep doing your thing.